Dear Morgan, I have loved you from the very first time I laid eyes on you. You have been there for me through hard times and good times. Although we won't talk about the time you didn't come visit me in the hospital as I was dying, but I suppose I'll let it fly for now. Morgan, I cannot express how excited I am to call you my partner for life. There will be no hill that we won't conquer, no battle we won't win as long as we stay together. I promise to you that I will be the best husband to you that I can possibly be. I promise to love and to take care of you so long as I live. There is nothing that I would not do for you in order to protect you. I cannot express in simple words on a page what you and Kaylin mean to me. I promise that our little family is going to last forever. Just know from this day forward, I will always consider us one whole being and I will never let go of you and protect you and our family forever and always. Love your forever partner in life, Titsy. Tayden, you love to tell the story of when we first met. You like to joke about how I said I love you first, and up until now I have always told you that it was an accident. But I think part of me knew that you were my person. You often hear that our journey starts today. I think it's continuing, it's maturing, but it definitely isn't starting today. It actually started when you asked Keisha if she had any friends. It started when you asked to meet my little boy. It started when you got down on one knee and asked me to spend the rest of our lives together. When I look at you, I see home. I see my favorite part of my past and I see every day for the rest of my life. You're all I ever hoped for and nothing I ever expected. I promise to be your peace in this chaotic world as you are for me. You are my strength when I am weak, my comfort when I am anxious, and the place I feel the safest. I love you, Tayden, and I always will. To the boy you were, the man you have become, and to all the versions of you that I can't wait to meet. Tayden, in the past couple years, you have truly found your purpose as a friend, a husband, a father, and most importantly, a farmer. <laughs> Tayden, Tayden, you truly are my brother from another mother. <laughs> Even though we are at different points in our lives and separated by distance, we are family. Through thick and thin, the good times and the bad times. Tayden, I am so happy that Morgan found you and that you were willing to put up with her attitude, her obsession with needing 15 different kinds of animals, <laughs> her weird quirks and shopping addiction. Seriously though, it has been great to watch you support Morgan in everything she does from starting her business to telling her how great she looks in her new shirt. Not only have you supported Morgan, you have supported me and become like a brother to me. It is truly great to officially call you a part of the family, and Tayden, always remember, if Morgan is mad, she's probably, she probably just needs food. These are the hands which will work alongside you, will build your future as you laugh and cry, as you share your innermost secrets and dreams. These hands which appear so large and strong today will work long hours for you and your family. They are the hands which will passionately love and cherish you throughout the years. The same hands will wipe away tears of sorrow and tears of joy. These are the hands which will comfort you in the times of illness, which will hold you when grief intrudes your home, these are the hands which will tenderly lift your chin and brush your cheek as they raise your face to look into his eyes, eyes that will be filled with love for you. These are the hands of your best friend, smooth and carefree, which are holding yours on this wedding day as she pledges her love and commitment to you for all the days of her life. These are the hands which will hold you tight as you struggle through difficult times. They're the hands which will comfort you when you're sick and will console you when you grieve. The hands which will passionately love and cherish you through all the years of your life. The same hands will support you as you pursue the dreams of all that God has enabled and called you to become. Together, as a team, God will honor your family and accomplish his will in your lives.
Caden, do you take Morgan to be your wife, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and cherish until you are parted by death according to God's holy ordinance. Morgan, do you take Caden to be your husband, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and cherish until you are parted by death according to God's holy ordinance. cultivate a relationship based on trust and faith and I pray to God to have a relationship like yours I love both of you from the bottoms of my heart and I'm so happy to share in the joy of your wedding cheers to the Vandenbergs love is their parents and grandparents but for me it's you too I hope to someday have a love like yours Morgan and Tayden you have a beautiful family I can't wait to watch it grow so I can spoil Kaylin and my future nieces or nephews so congrats and I wish you a lifetime of happiness
could be in the club we could dance it up in the hotel lobby we don't need a lot of fancy stuff just pull me some of that feel good coffee don't need a hold down to throw down show me some moves now you good now sunshine look at you oh yeah you